Welcome. Welcome to CTN Videos. Today I have a iOS tips and tricks video on how to turn off location services on your iOS device. In order to do this, and what brought this up is Google Now. Now if you have that and you have it running, it the chances of it draining your battery life could be high. Um, according to according to the not Google, um, it drains your battery life significantly. According to Google, it doesn't at all. Just a little bit. So if you want to turn it off and follow your gut, go to settings. Go to, once you're at the top, go to scroll down to privacy. You don't really have to scroll down if you don't want to. Then location services. You can turn them all off just like that. If you don't want any app accessing it, which I would recommend having a couple accessing it. I would not recommend camera and other apps like that, but apps that use your weather or anything else like Siri um, or your weather app, I would I would recommend letting it use that, especially map icons. But scroll down to find Google. Then you can, um, it'll be on like that. Then you can just slide off and it's off. If you have any other apps that you want to turn it off, follow the same steps. And if you see an icon like this one right here, that gray one, the gray um, arrow, you can scroll down to the chart, and that means a gray location services icon will appear next to an item that has used your location within the last 24 hours. Then you can scroll down more, and it gives you system services. Once you're there, you have the diagnostics and usages, the location-based iAds, and setting time zone. And that um, has the same um, um, icons here. And then you have the status bar icon, which will... Um, if you check yes, it will tell you when one of these is using your location. So that's nice. Thank you for watching CTN videos. Please check back soon. We are on Twitter and Facebook. Go ahead and follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook. We post often on both of those. We post up-to-date technology news and when we have new videos coming out on our YouTube channel. We also have a website at ctntechnews.com. And believe it or not, we have a podcast. And you can search in iTunes at CTN's Technology Podcast, and you will find our podcast there. Go ahead and subscribe to that, too. You can also send any feedback to us at ctn7705 at gmail.com. Thank you again.